Melissa, I am so sorry that you're going through all this. I know it's got to be gut-wrenching, heart-wrenching. But you have told us that you do not blame the now-dead janitor, Khalil Tatum, for murdering his wife or kidnapping your missing grandchild. Why not? And look at this precious what child. I, uh, what I said was, I don't believe that he killed his wife. Uh, why not? I, 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 what I said to the reporter that interviewed me, I never said I don't blame him. What I said was, I don't believe that he killed his wife. What I believe, what I feel right now, and what I believe since finding out that he was found murdered, well, that he committed suicide, I believe his wife walked in and interrupted something or heard something or seen something that she wasn't supposed to see or know, and that's why she lost her life. Well, if Just he like, didn't kill her, who did? I don't know. Maybe it could have been one of the ones that left that was seen at the hotel with them. Uh, one See, of the really, ones. Really, I don't know who could have killed so them. Tell, tell, us, did, tell or... us about that because authorities are saying, and we see the surveillance video of your precious grandchild with this man, this janitor, on February 26th, walking into a hotel room. Never a good sign for an adult man and an eight-year-old girl to be walking into a hotel room. There it is. Now, well, uh, authorities haven't got... said about anything else about anybody else, but you're giving us new information. What, what are you saying? What the family got for us that video about him being, him and her being seen in the hotel, in the confident over there on, uh, well, that hotel over there on New York Avenue, she was, she went to a pool party. They were supposed to have a, her, his granddaughter, now your granddaughter was supposed to have a pool party at a hotel, uh, indoor, at the indoor pool there at the hotel. You mentioned something about never, uh, other pool, people. I don't know if a party took place there or not. You said just now about something about other people. What other people? The hotel where his wife was found was in Oxen Hill. The hotel where Relisha and Mr. Tatum were seen at is here in the, the District of Columbia. Right. It was five people. It was three other people seen entering that hotel room with him and his wife. So we don't know who could have killed wow. his wife. Maybe one of them, maybe Mr. Tatum. We don't know. Only those that were in the room know who actually killed his wife. Now, some might say, why are you so quick to defend somebody who um, your granddaughter disappeared on his watch? Um, and let me just set it up. I'm not him at all. My thing is, you got two people that turned up dead, okay? In Mr. Tatum's case, where they found him at, they searched that same very exact location when they first started searching for my granddaughter. They found nothing, no, no signs of him nor my granddaughter at that very exact location. On Monday, Monday just passed, you get a tip that leads you right back to that location, what you find when you get back to that same very location that you already searched prior to beginning the search for my granddaughter, and you find his body. That should tell you something. If so you you're suggesting that somebody first somebody it, dropped his body there and planted his body there. Right. You're almost suggesting... That's a conspiracy. That's, that's, what I, that's what I feel. That someone killed him, someone else, and put his body there and then called Metropolitan and told them to go back, that they will find something. It, it almost sounds like so you're I'm suggesting... I'm not Mr. Tatum in any, well, any type of way. Okay, what do you think happened to your granddaughter? What, what do you think happened to your granddaughter? I don't know what happens to her. See, it's, right now, it's a lot only... Like I said, in his wife's case, the only ones know that killed her is the ones that was there. The whereabouts of my granddaughter, the only one that knows the whereabouts right now is Mr. Tatum, and he's deceased. Now, if he killed himself, the question leads now, who was she present when he murdered himself, or did he leave her with someone else? Well, you know, what you're suggesting is also, if you extrapolate, you're suggesting maybe he didn't kill himself, that he was killed and planted there. Oh my gosh, my right. head is exploding that's, that's with this conspiracy that's theory. That's 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 what I feel. That's that's my my opinion on how they found the body and where they found the gun laying at. That's my opinion on it. I feel okay. as though Mrs. Hayden's body wanna... was put there by someone.